It is really dark down here, but I thought this two pack of cheap umbrella lights might help. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Hey, if you have a studio, maybe just a workplace where you're taking some photographs. For me, I like filming every now and then, and I needed a little more light in this area here because obviously it is really dark. I've got a lamp on over there. It's not doing a whole lot. But I found this two pack of umbrella lights by E-Mart. Shop. Smart shop e mart, and I thought this would be great because you know a single umbrella light can actually be you know 30 or 40 bucks. And I thought, hey, this is one that is about half that price because it's the same price for two lamps. So we get two umbrellas here, these light diffusing umbrellas. We also get a bunch of boxes here. So I will tell you that I think we're just gonna have duplicative stuff here. But you can see, maybe in the dark light here, this is the light bulb holder. It comes on this little tiny articulating arm. It's got a plug here, so it will just power it like a socket. You can put the stand bar in the bottom here, and this will allow you to angle it up and down. There's also a hole that goes all the way through here. You might be able to see. And that's where the umbrella will stick into if you want to use that. In this bigger box, this is the workhorse portion of it. And it should be a light bulb. And as you can see here, it's a CFL spiral. Pretty big. Hopefully that should be pretty bright. We'll find out. And then in these two boxes, we get the stands. So they are tripods. And you might go see they are folded up pretty nicely here. They kind of splay out like this kind of moves the bar up and then there's a thumb screw right here to screw them down so you can adjust these and then they telescope up here so you have a couple of snaps that come out like this and now I can adjust this to whatever height I need and we have actually two telescoping portions so you can really get some height on that I am going to want them probably about eye level so I'm just going to kind of snap them in right about here and I'm just going to put it I'm gonna unscrew screw on the back drop it on top of the post, let it fall down. Now when I screw this in, it kind of goes into a notch in the post, which is great. What I found is it sometimes it's helpful to take the umbrella first like this, and then put that in here, a little space, and then you can put the umbrella in like that. And then tighten this down. I want these generally to go straight forward, take the light bulb and just screw it in, and then plug it in. Now, because I have one other one, I'm gonna set up both of these, flank the camera right there, and let's see if it makes a difference. All right, I have both of these lights set up here, just like this, so I will put that back, and that's the only lighting aside from that one light that's way off there. So, just with these two little umbrella lights, what a big difference. Now you can add some more auxiliary lights. If you wanted to replace those CFLs with LEDs, I think that would even help a little bit. But I love the fact that these umbrellas actually diffuse the light a bit. It makes it a little softer. You know, it kind of lights everything up evenly. And so I really like that. And the best part is that this set is really, really cheap. So it's an easy way to go if you want to just up your lighting game in your videos. If you want to pick them up, I'll put a link to them in the description below. Peter Von Panda out.